Welcome to the channel, you beautiful people. I hope you guys are having yourself a wonderful uh, day. Before we get started with today's video, guys, I wanted to share with you guys a cool book. Uh, so I've been uh, living for like 20 years in, in uh, um, the city called Richmond here in uh, uh, Canada, in, in British Columbia. And majority of uh, the population uh, were from, you know, Asian background, from, from uh, China. So, so I grew up, for example, eating like, you know, fried rice and chow mein and sushi and lots of like for example asian dishes but i never actually got to learn about the um asian like uh, dinner etiquette so i came across this book it's called the uh, Ch chinese business dinner uh, culture and it's uh, pretty cool it actually uh, teaches you the proper way of for example uh, toast you know for example with with tea that they drink or, or those who maybe drink uh, alcohol how to properly uh, hold a chopsticks and there are different ways of holding a chopstick which i found pretty cool so um you know i thought it was just only a single way but they're actually uh, quite different ways of holding it and each of them have their own unique names uh, and as well they actually talk about sitting arrangements so where you should sit um, so it's pretty pretty cool uh, you can get the book from Amazon and I have the link in the description so you guys can uh, check it out and again again it's called the Chinese business dinner uh, culture so it's pretty cool like I said it gives you a good overview of uh, what to expect and how to basically have a proper dinner without uh, uh, being rude to your uh, host so since i found it pretty cool and exciting and uh, uh, basically i learned quite a bit from it i wanted to share that uh, with you guys too so with that said guys in today's video we'll be reacting to a indonesian military robot this video was suggested by diki sbk thank you very much for taking the time to send me a recommendation and a suggestion the video is by pt ansa and the link is in the description in case you guys wanted to check it out so inshallah we'll get started with the video in just a couple of uh, seconds and at the end of the video i'll share with you guys my observation and reactions so if you want to see that then please stay until the end of uh, the video and with that said guys now let's get started So it seems like it's some kind of, uh, I guess, a robot maybe has a gun because it says sentry gun and it's a test, it, like, I guess they're testing the gun. So let's see, it should be exciting. There you go, sentry gun. Mm. It's a good quality video. Oh, wow, there we go. Here comes the robot tank. It's huge. I know here Spano they have like tanks like that, not tanks, sorry, robots like that they use for like bomb, uh, you know, in case there's like a bomb danger or something that they send that and that robot has hands and it cuts wires and stuff. But here maybe it's different because they talk about gun. TNI, UGI Cobra. They took the the robot, they put it on a truck, they put the truck on a barge <laughs> and I think they're gonna take it out in the water. testing the trucks like breaking distance with the robot uh, on its back. Oh wow, has actually even room for an operator, that's cool. I thought it was just like remote control. Sensor optic, oh wow. 
That's crazy. Acoustic censorship picks up sound. Wow. Manual control, yeah, so the driver can be in there. Grand control system, so there you go. It is actually remote control too. The crazy thing is how it locks in on the target. A big round of applause to the Indonesian engineers and military for building such a cool uh, robot. That was pretty neat. Um, I thought it was just like, you know, a remote control, but it actually has room for, a, a, you know, a manual operator, like somebody to sit in there and control it. And the cool thing was how it would locked onto the target and also have like a sound sensor so it could pick up where the sound is coming from, which is really, really neat. You know, nowadays, that's where the uh, army is uh, going towards, you know, all uh, the world's militaries are uh, basically making their equipment more um, intelligent, uh, more, uh, you know, remote controlled, for example, you know, drones we have seen. Uh, and uh, now it's tanks and also, uh, you know, f uh, fighter jets going to be soon and, and uh, a lot of other things, right? Because that's where everything is moving. So this was pretty interesting. It's it's. Uh, pretty cool you know they have that so you know they can use it in uh, defensive or defensive uh, purposes so thank you very much guys for suggesting this video i hope you guys enjoyed it if you did then please don't forget to like comment share and subscribe and as always guys thank you very much for all your love and support i hope you guys have yourself a wonderful day take care of yourself and your family and inshallah i'll see you guys in the next video take care